Eclipse IDE has a great support for the Git version control system. That is through the eGit project using its plugins. In this video, we will see how to install eGit to Eclipse. Let's first go to the browser and type eGit download. It brings us to this page. Here is the main update site http download.eclipse.org slash eGit slash updates. Let's copy this URL. Now I have Spring Tool Suite running on my machine here, which is an Eclipse based distribution. To install eGit to Eclipse, you would go to Help, Install New Software. Let us paste the URL in the text box. Click Add. Let us give it a name of eGit. It shows the various pieces which will be installed. For instance, Git integration for Eclipse, which brings support for Git versioning, GitHub, GitFlow, etc. Let us check all three. Click Next. Click Next again. Accept the agreement and click Finish. Eclipse downloads and installs it. Now Eclipse requires us to restart it for the install to complete. So let's restart it. Alright, eGit is installed. As a good practice, we should add the user name and the user email to Git configuration so that Git includes it in every commit for you. So to do that, let's go to Windows, Preferences, Team, Git, Configuration and User Settings. Let's click Add Entry and enter key as user.name and value as charge ahead. Click OK. Let us click Add Entry again and enter the key as user.email and value. Click OK. Click Apply and Close. And now we are ready to work with Git using Eclipse. Thanks for watching.